everybody, and welcome to a bonus video from MinMax. MinMax is a place about games, friends, and getting better. My name is Ben Hansen. Thank you for being here. I'm joined today by the master of game music, dare I say it, Emily Reese. Hi. Hi. Welcome <laughs> from the Level with Emily podcast. Emily, uh, thank you for joining me on this very music-focused video. There's nobody I'd rather have at my side to analyze game music than you, so thank you. Amazing. Why, well, thank you for having me. I'm excited to get everything wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so what this is, we should set the scene a little bit. So um, I went to a preview event uh, for Mario and Rabbids Sparks of Hope. On uh, It's releasing October 20th, but I went to it uh, last week in San Francisco. I share my full impressions of my time with the game. Got to play three hours. Overall, I was really impressed. I like the first game. I think this is, based on those three hours, uh, much more impressive. I really enjoyed my time with it. Um, and I talk about it all on the MinMax Show podcast, the most recent episode on this YouTube channel, or you can subscribe to it on your favorite podcast app. We'd appreciate it. Um, but specifically, what I was curious about is the soundtrack for Sparks of Hope, because a while ago they announced that this new game has a ridiculous soundtrack. The first game, Kingdom Battle, composed by Grant Kirkhope, uh, who you know is the composer for a thousand different games. I mean, going back to old rare stuff like Goldeneye, Banjo-Kazooie, Donkey Kong 64, of course. But then more recent stuff like Kingdoms of Amalur, Ukulele, a ton of stuff, right? Um, and then Sparks of Hope, not only is Grant Kirkhope composing a third of it, but then also Gareth Coker is jumping in and composing a third, uh, roughly ballpark, and right? And Gareth Coker is the composer for stuff like the Ori series. He was one of the composers for Halo Infinite, uh, Immortals Phoenix Rising, incredible composer in their own right. And then uh, the legend enters the party as well with Yoko Shimomura is also composing music for Mario and Rabbids Sparks of Hope. And she is known for stuff like Kingdom Hearts, Final Fantasy XV, Live Alive, which just got re-released this year, going back to Street Fighter II, Super Mario RPG. Um, so with those three legends working on this game, I thought, well, I want to do one thing with this capture session that I have here, uh, where I'm just going to go ahead and jump in and move all the sliders down in the menu for audio, except for music, because I just want to capture this music, and I thought it'd be fun to make it more engaging for everybody watching on Twitch. Everybody watching on YouTube, by the way, after the fact, hello, please follow MinMax on Twitch. But everybody watching live on Twitch, I thought it'd be fun to make a trivia show out of this. So everybody on Twitch will have to vote track by track, and we're going to be showing some new gameplay as well here, but really focusing on the music, and you're going to be voting track by track on if this track is composed by Grant Kirkhope, Gareth Coker, or Yoko Shimomura. Emily, how are you feeling about this? Do you think you're going to do okay? No, absolutely <laughs> not. <laughs> I think I'm going to crash and burn. I, it, it, honestly, it depends, uh, you know, on how similarly they were asked to, re, you know, yeah. write their music, right? So, mm -hmm. but okay. no, I'm, I'm not feeling confident, even a little. Okay. Not even a little. I understand yeah. this is like some high level game trivia for everybody. So I made a little cheat sheet. If you're watching on Twitch, you can see this, Emily. So here's oh, okay. some of the credits. So you have a frame of reference for what they sound like. And let me just put it up. So this is a Grant Kirkhope song to give you a flavor of his music, especially for Mario and Rabbids, because this is from Kingdom Battle. Okay. So listen to this a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Grant Kirkhope. Oh, hang on. I don't want to stop listening to this. It's so fun. All right. You get the idea there that's Grant Kirkhope's music for Kingdom Battle, so be aware of those vibes. Also, I mean, you got to play some legends from Grant Kirkhope here. Goldeneye pause theme, which got a whole new life thanks to TikTok. So, you know, you know the range of Grant Kirkhope here, everybody. Yeah. Oh, so good. So good. Okay, and then just for a little taste of where everybody else is at, and not that we can you know, boil down these composers' excellent work to these tracks, but just to give you a flavor, right? This is uh, Gareth Coker. Main theme for Ori and the Blind Forest. <clears throat> How would you describe Gareth Coker's sound if you could generalize it, Emily? Uh, wow. Um, he's really good at big epic orchestral things. Like he ha he writes with like a lot of emotion. If I were to compare him to Grant Kirkhope, like I think of Grant Kirkhope as also having those qualities, but being more humorous. Like right, um, right. And Gareth's music tends to be 
I don't want to, I feel like generalizing is unfair. Well, but, that's what this know, show is serious. all about, Emily. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, and then just to keep generalizing, uh, here's some music from Yoko Shimomura, my favorite track from Final Fantasy XV here. All right, Yoko Shimomura, absolutely a legend. Oh, good. Okay, so now let's actually get to some real stuff here. Let's get to some God. clips from Mario and Rabbids Sparks of Hope, the soundtrack. I think this is this is geared up to be probably the soundtrack of the year. Uh, I, mean, I mean, Emily, I don't know. We talk about this on the Min Max show, I guess, once a year. But what do you think is the strongest soundtrack released this year so far, game-wise? Oh, really? You want me to go I there don't now? Know. I, I mean, don't know. I've just got a list. Well, to, to number one, if you had to just wing it, what do you think is the strongest soundtrack this year? Uh, probably, I mean, it's quite a spectrum, but either, I can't, I can't not say Elden Ring, and okay. also I, I can't not say Far Changing Tides. Oh. Probably my, my ultimate favorite is I Far Changing it. Tides. All right, deep cut. Mm -hmm. I like it. Um, okay, yeah. everybody. This is the first bit of gameplay and music from Mario and Rabbids Sparks of Hope. So listen to the song and then try and guess, based on the poll that we're going to put up on Twitch here, who is the composer for this. All right, here we go, everybody. Good luck. This feels like Trivia Tower. One minute to lock in your vote, everybody. Reminder, here are your options. Let's see, a lot of people saying Kirk Hope, saying that ain't Coker. Okay. All right, everybody. Emily. You don't have to sway this, but do you feel like you know? I feel like I have an educated guess. I do not feel like I know. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. What, um, what, do you, what do you look for when you're trying to figure something like this out? Um, you know, kind of style, because Japanese classical style is so different than um, Western yeah. classical. Um, so I, I listened for the kind of giveaways to, to assume it's Japanese. Um, there, you know, from a Japanese perspective, I don't know. I don't want to say that wrong. But no, no, no. I think, I think there's something there. Also, you know, the humor, the humor again is just like, because okay, this is a very humorous track, right? It's got right. a lot of fun in it. I definitely would also throw my weight behind Grant Kirkhope, but I also feel like you're trying to throw us off. Interesting. So. The first track in this little tournament was composed by somebody who got zero votes. That was it Gareth was Coker, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Hey, you know what? It's going to okay. be tough. It's going to be tough. That was a Gareth yep. Coker joint. Yep. <sighs> Look, no one's perfect. No one's perfect here. This is going to be no. tough for everybody. I mean, okay. can we do Beethoven, Mozart, and Haydn after this? Then yeah. I'll nail it. I mean, let's keep it rolling. Absolutely. Oh, <laughs> a classical music-centric episode of Trivia Tower in the future where it's all just, oh, that'd be really hardcore and, and no really fun. No one wants that. Yeah. <laughs> I took a class on Schoenberg, so maybe I'd be okay at that. Ooh, all right. Nice. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sophisticated, Emily. Indeed, indeed. Okay, here we go. Uh, this is okay. track number two, everybody. And it's not like this is the second track on the soundtrack. I shouldn't even number them this way. But all right, who composed this battle theme for Marion Rabbids' Sparks of Hope? Here you go.
<laughs> Someone says, look me in the eye and tell me this isn't a Final Fantasy drag. <laughs> All right, what are you hearing, Emily? Um, oh, I just clicked off the thing. Okay, here we go. Um, yeah, I, I think, oh man, I just messed it all up. I think, I do think that's Yoko as well. Um, but, you know, I feel like I'm failing. It's okay. I think it's Yoko. All right, the answer, ladies and gentlemen. Well, the poll comes in 79% of people thought that it was Yoko Shimamura. It is, in fact, Yoko Shimamura. Congratulations. Way to go, everybody. Okay. You did it. You did it in a yeah. big way. Okay, here's Not the next track, everybody. Games. Yeah, go ahead. Gotcha. Here we go. Good luck. This is really just a listening party, really. Good. <laughs> Good. More videos should be listening parties. sheet up again for you so you can vote accurately okay there's there's the sample that was the full loop there everybody we'll see how everybody's looking here and the votes are rolling in hmm. interesting interesting Gareth Coker is at 81% currently Yoga Shimamura has one vote. Grant Kirkhope has two votes. Are you leaning a direction, Emily? I am. It's always hard with ambient music, though, right? Yeah. So this is like an ambi track. Yeah. How much style and personality can you put into it? But yeah. Eh. But I, I said, do you want me to tell you what I thought? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I, th I, I said Gareth wrote this. Okay. Uh, well, when the votes are done, I will tell you that definitively this track was composed by. Grant Kirkhope! Okay, I wonder if you're gonna do that to us. <laughs> I'm not you're trying. Mean. Look, I'm surprised as well. I'm not trying to be a little stinker here, I swear. This is <laughs> this is surprising to me. Yeah. Uh, all right, there we go. Uh, look, you can never predict. This this is a lesson in not uh, really boiling down composers to just the simplest exactly. answer, right? Yep. Okay, here we go, everybody. Next track, who composed this one here? is at five votes, Yoko Shimomura is at six votes. Okay. Yoko is at 10, Gareth at nine. It's going back and forth here, they're both at 10. Good God, people on Twitch, choose wisely. The answer is... Yoko Shimamura takes it with 11 votes. And the correct answer is that was Yoko Shimamura. Way to go, chat. Way to go, killing it. Very nice. impressive, everybody. Very impressive you're able to nail that one. Okay. Here we go. Uh, that was number four. This is number five. Who composed this track here? Another kind of ambient one.
Boats are rolling in. some high-level gameplay happening here as I get confused about basic aspects of where to go. People watching me stream are used to. All right. Who's it gonna be, everybody? Who's it gonna be? Mildly Raven says, honestly, this music is making me interested in the game. Yeah, you should. It's, I mean, they are paying for the soundtrack and it shows. It's very impressive. And Kirk hopes at eight, Shimamura's at three, Coker's at nine. Ooh, who ended up taking it? Was it Coker? Coker with nine! This is Yoko Shimamura, everybody. Ooh, yeah. lovely. Can't judge it. Can't judge it, even though the point of the stream is to judge it. <laughs> Way to go, everybody. Um, Emily, somebody in chat saying, who's Emily Reese again? What do they do? Um, what is your oh. area of music expertise? How should people learn more about uh, your taste in music and your knowledge of music? Um, you can check out the podcast Level with Emily, where I interview composers of games. And oh man, I've got so many good shows coming up. I have five interviews in the next week, so that'll set me on a pretty great path for a while. Yeah. But uh, but yeah, yeah. So yeah, you can um, just learn about me on on the webs Level with Emily or Level with Emily Reese. Yeah, I assume I'm, we have a Discord server too, and it's not, it doesn't cost. You can just hop on in and say hi and talk about games and music. Yeah, I assume <laughs> you've interviewed Gareth Coker and Grant Kirkhope at least, right? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Yep. I, I talked with Gareth. It's been a minute, but yeah, I've talked to him about Ark and oh, yeah. The or both Ori's. And with Grant, I think we talked about kingdoms of amalur which is i love that game and i love that soundtrack it's yeah so yeah people forget that he did that but it really shows the range oh. you know yeah it's so good so beautiful okay here we go next one who composed this Leaning Grant Kirko. Yoko Shimura's at four votes. Gareth Coker at two. Ooh. Yoko is climbing. Grant Kirkhope won it with eight votes. Yoko Shimomura at seven. The answer was Yoko Shimomura, everybody. <laughs> what doubt. I'm learning from this is that I don't know shit. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, it's pretty rare to have a collaboration like this. And I think it's interesting. Yeah, it's like, yeah, yeah. you can't pigeonhole these folks. They can, they got a whole range. <laughs> uh, all right. Yeah, no, that sounds great. Um, that off. Oh, yeah, people in the chat were saying, oh, yeah, you're in the Minneapolis travelogue. You had a Juicy Lucy with us, right? 10 out of 10, and don't let anybody <laughs> tell you any different. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, here we go, everybody. Seventh track. Good luck. Who composed this?
Gareth Coker's at eight. Yoko's at two, Grant's at three. Emily, which way are you leaning on this one? I think I, I voted Grant. I think I voted for Grant for Hope. Interesting. Okay. It just comes down he, to the fun again for you? I just keep voting for Grant, hoping I'll get it right <laughs> at some point. I, I'm, I'm along, like, with That's Mildly Raven is the same way, like, right. voting for Coker. Like, I'm like, I'm just going to keep voting for Grant Kirk Hope. <laughs> Solid strategy, but unfortunately, everybody voted I Gareth Coker, and everybody was wrong. Also, Yoko Shimamura, everybody. Also, Yoko Shimamura. Amazing. Now, look, maybe just the sections they had us play ha was leaning one way or, or the other, you know, for the tracks that are just in this section. But talking to a producer, yeah. at least, they're like, yeah, it's roughly like a third for the soundtrack each. But Interesting. Okay, here we go, everybody. Let's see. Next track. People think they know. Uh, Yoko Shimomura's at two, Garrett's at three, Grant Kirkhope's at six for this one. Interesting, interesting. <laughs> Emily, which way are you leaning? This time I voted for Gareth, I believe. Okay, interesting. Who can say if that's the right call? I mean, I will in like five seconds, but... You, you can. Yeah, actually, that's true. Uh, all right, Grant Kirkhope won the poll with nine votes there. The composer of this track, Grant Kirkhope, ladies and gentlemen. You got one. You Amazing. absolutely got one. There we Which go. Way, did I vote that wrong? Did I, did I say Gareth? I think you said Gareth. <laughs> but... <laughs> That's all right. Look, it's it's a tough it's a tough game. There's no doubt. All right, last one, everybody. Oop, let's see. Let's turn this on. All right, last I did. last time you get to try and figure out who composed this track. This is, I believe, the second phase of this boss fight at the end of the demo, which was um, surprisingly tricky. Um, all right, everybody. And again, to learn more impressions about the gameplay for uh, Mario and Rabbit Sparks of Hope, you can check out the Mid Max Show podcast. We'd appreciate it. Okay, here we go. Last chance, everybody. Who composed this music? Gareth Coker at eight, Yoko Shimomura at five, Grant Kirkhope at two. Emily, what are you thinking? 
Oh God, I folded and I voted for Gareth again just because he hasn't, he didn't, you know, play many in the tracks. It's true. <laughs> All right, Gareth Coker is at 10 votes. He takes it. The answer was Grant Kirkhope, everybody. <laughs> Grant Kirkhope. <laughs> Again, I didn't know who composed what when I jumped into this, so I feel bad that it was only one Gareth track to, to kick it off, but I'm sure his contributions are amazing on the rest of the soundtrack here. I'm sure they are. Whew. Uh, great job, everybody. Thanks, everybody, for checking this out, for following us on Twitch, everybody watching us on YouTube. Thank you. Please give us a follow on Twitch. We stream um, a new show plus option, which is really silly, every Tuesday. Also, gameplay every Tuesday, uh, every Thursday as well. We have a new show debuting this Thursday as well, so a lot of stuff happening, so we'd appreciate it. Emily, thanks for being here. So happy to be here. Uh, I'm just thanking everybody in the chat and saying <laughs> okay. that at least we got to hear a bunch of great new music, even yeah. if we couldn't let our knowledge shine. That's through right. These tracks. But again, if people wanted to find out where your knowledge is shining, where should they go? Uh, Level with Emily, anywhere you get your podcasts. We're also on YouTube. We've got videos of chats up. Uh, so Level with Emily Reese. And then if you're local, if you live in Minnesota, I'm going to start being on the air again soon on Minnesota Public Radio News. So you can hear me on the radio. And then you can also uh, just find me anywhere you get podcasts or over on the YouTubes. Yeah, so, awesome. Yeah. All right. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. We appreciate it. If you enjoy this type of content, you can help support it directly by telling a friend about MinMax, by subscribing to our YouTube channel, or, hell, uh, supporting us on Patreon. There's a ton of benefits to unlock at patreon.com slash minmax with two N's. We appreciate it. All right. Thanks so much, everybody. We'll see you next time. Bye. If you thought, hey, this video wasn't bad, well, there's a whole lot more like it on MinMax's YouTube channel. Please help us out by subscribing to our channel and checking out the MinMax Show podcast, also available on your favorite podcast app, the best, most thorough discussion about games on the internet with the deepest dive, our monthly community trivia show with prizes called Trivia Tower, and a whole lot more. Thanks so much for your support, everybody. All you gotta do is click that subscribe button. We'd really appreciate it.